STEAM pathways in school curriculum have a really important role. We're wanting our students to be able to relate their experiences here at school to what happens out in real life and particularly in industry and different job roles. It's really important for them to see how what they're learning does apply into those other areas. Clidian's a company that does software and hardware. At the core of what we do is a unique algorithm that we designed. And what we've done with that technology is to cascade that into our software products. But we've also extended that technology into the physical world. Well, I suppose the physical world in terms of holograms. What I found really interesting was like how realistic the holograms were. I didn't know it was possible to do that. Technology and data are playing a huge role in evolving the sort of landscape of manufacturing here in Queensland. The STEAM programs that are being taught in schools feed those skills, empower those kids to understand things that their adults that are generally out there with traditional fields don't understand. It was really different to what I thought it would be. Bustex, the market leader in Australia for manufacturing both chassis and bus bodies. Our mantra is all about being proudly Australian and we, our current supply base is 99.8% Australians. We have welders, mechanics, panel fitters, design engineers, graphic designers, painters, we have electricians, so we cover a broad spectrum of skills. There's people downstairs creating and then you walk outside and people actually building it physically. The value I can see STEAM having for the transition from school to industry, I think bringing the kids in at this stage, they're growing up in a generation with technology, they'll bring new ideas to the table and mixed in with what they already know, I think it'll be, it's, it's key to the future. The amazing thing was that this is all being made in Australia. I thought it was going to be like all dirty and oily, but it was actually pretty clean. Ferro is an aerospace and defence manufacturing company. We want to do all the smart stuff here because that's what we're good at, and I think that's what Australians are good at. Having a trade background and, and strong technical experience will definitely open doors for you and make you very employable. So I started in manufacturing as a fitter and turner, and now I travel the world with Ferrer in a quality assurance role. It seems quite interesting in the uh, design, like being able to create like structures. Ordira is a collection of doctors, engineers and musicians and we make headphones with a built-in hearing test so that everyone gets perfect sound always. I would not have thought that he was a doctor, like building headphones. I liked how they could customise the music to make it sound great for you and I didn't realise that so many, everyone has different hearing. Manufacturing and design in Queensland is going to be different from how we would traditionally view it. Time is right for that balance between education and industry and it's happening every day. Teamwork is needed in companies so that you can make your product and make it good. The visit to our industry partners in the last two days has captured the interest of our students and our staff. The excursion was really great because um, you don't often realise what you have in your area until like, you actually go and look for those certain things. I think the value that the students had from the excursion was to actually see manufacturing and engineering and the integration of digital technologies happening in real life. I didn't realise the technology was actually so important and I also want to do a bit more science because I also never really thought why well, you need to learn about the world but now I'm starting to see that it isn't just pointless. The number one piece of advice I'd have for students is to take advantage of all the amazing opportunities we have around us. If you want to be involved in technology, if you want to be involved in manufacturing, just put your hand up. The opportunities are there and it's on you to grab them with both hands.